So we are here at Topayo Bus Interchange and we're gonna try this new concept called Bow and Bow. The thing that really attracted me to want to try this is because they use an automatic uh, egg fried rice machine. Right? So in the store you can see this machine will actually fry the rice automatically. So I'm very excited to go and try Bow and Bow here at Topayo. So at Bow and Bow, right, the special thing is that they actually have an automatic rice frying pan. All the ingredients are actually preset or actually done by a chef. So a chef has actually planned the ingredients. They just need to portion it out correctly and then the machine will add all the ingredients into the pan with the rice automatically. And the whole process is very unique. Right? I've never seen this in Singapore, right? So this is a very exciting thing that I'm seeing. So being from the F&B industry as well, I understand how hard is it to actually have a consistent manpower in the kitchen. Uh, with this new technology, it actually saves a lot of that issue. You have everything automatically programmed, they can get a very, very consistent uh, fried rice. And this is obviously Bo & Bo's specialty item here, the fried rice. You can see inside, there's actually like a little automatic stirrer thing. So it actually stirs the rice so it doesn't burn. The exact timing for each fried rice is 1 minute 43 seconds. No more, no less. So everything is super precise. You get very consistent fried rice. We are trying 4 different rice bowls here. So you have the beef cube one. We have a chicken floss. We have the salmon one. And this is the chicken mentaiko bowl. So bowl and bowl, as you can see, through the automatic fried rice uh, machine that they use, they can produce a very consistent egg fried rice, right? And the concept is a bit of a fusion concept. You have, you know, edamame, you have the corn, you have the tomatoes. So this is sort of like a mix with poke bowl and uh, you know, the healthy grain rice bowls uh, that you see in a lot of you know, CBD thinness areas. Okay, so let's dig in and try, let me try the beef over. Uh. Actually, I want to try the rice first. I'll try the rice first. Okay, okay. I like the fact that they use short grain rice. So you can see, here's like the zhen zhu mi. The rice is more on the lighter side, so not super savoury or very high in flavour. Um, yeah, so it, it has the sense of healthiness, you know. It's like a, it feels like a healthy fried rice because it's not uh, super salty, it's not like very heavy in my like, MSG or what. Uh, and it, it goes well with the ingredients. Uh. So it does have the sense of a healthy bowl, but still fried rice is fried rice. It tastes better than plain white rice. Yeah, so I, I like how they really use very colourful vegetables like the cherry tomato, edamame, the corn, and the uh, the pickles here. So this creates a very Instagrammy kind of grain bowl. Lah. So what I noticed here also is there is no pork um, being used in any of the dishes. Uh, however, they are not halal yet. Who knows in the future they might get. Yeah, but there's no pork in any of the ingredients lah, from my observation. I'm gonna try this other bowl's fried rice. Pretty much tastes the same, I think it's quite it's quite consistent. So there's actually mentaiko sauce on the salmon with the then aburi. So this adds an extra dimension to the salmon and the rice. Um, so there's also the poached egg that I mentioned. You can break it up um, and then let it mix into the rice. So that creates a bit more uh, texture, like it adds a bit that gooey stickiness to the rice. Uh, some people like that from the egg. Pretty affordable pricing. They have a few new outlets opening up in shopping malls, so you can check it out. This is actually a uh, new brand that's created, although the technology itself is, is also relatively new in Singapore. So we're back at office, uh, fried bowl and bowl. The fried rice, I'll say, uh, is a very healthy variation. La. So if you uh, are those that like poke bowl or like grain bowls with like brown rice, which I hate, uh, this is actually a good compromise because instead of brown rice, you actually have an egg fried rice which has a bit more flavour versus like a milk weight out of the brown rice. La. 
Yeah, but don't expect it to be like king of fried rice or Ting Tai Fung standard. Lah. Okay, this is a very light beef flavor egg fried rice and I think it will appeal to the CBD office workers lah, who are more conscious about their health. But if you're like me, you don't give a shit about that, then you know this probably wouldn't be for you. Right, so check out Bo and Bo. They're at Topayo and they are I think opening a few more outlets uh, in a few malls. Lah. Right, so check it out. This is Seth. Bye bye.